everyone! Welcome to the 2021 VBS Destination Dig at KPCG. Today is the first day and day one's truth is Jesus came as God promised. Each day I'm going to share a story from the Bible to review what Pastor Kim preached in his sermon. You should have received five daily quiz sheets. As we review each day's Bible story, fill in the answers and then ask your parents to send a picture of it to the VBS channel on Katok by 5 p.m. that day. Not only are we going to have a story time, but we're also going to have an activity and craft each day. After you do each activity and make each craft, make sure to write your name on them and save them. Because on Saturday, July 3rd, we, you will bring your crafts and activities and drop it off at church. And then July 4th, is, that's when we're going to have our showroom day, okay? So make sure you save each craft and activity, write your name on it, and bring it on July 3rd to church. Now take out the day one daily quiz and a pencil. It's story time! Alright everyone, look in your package and you should see something like this. This is our map. Have you found it yet? Good! So take this out. You should also see a Ziploc bag with stickers on it. With stickers that say day one, day two, all the way to day five. Have you found it? Good! So we're gonna take this and we're gonna untie and let's open it up. Alright, and it should look like this. This is our map of our destination dig of VBS. Each day, we're going to take this map and we're going to take a sticker and we're going to put it on there to show that we are on each day's destination. Okay? So take out for day one. So take one that says uh, Jesus is the Savior God promised and put it on the map that has the circle for day one. Good job! So, do you know when Jesus' birthday is? That's right, it's December 25th! But wait, you might say, it's not Christmas. Why are we talking about Jesus' birth in the summer? That's because this story is not just for Christmas time. Did you know that hundreds of years before Jesus was born, God told the prophets about His plan to send His Son to be our Savior. The prophet Isaiah wrote that God's Son would be Emmanuel, which means God with us. The prophet Micah wrote that God's Son would be born in Bethlehem. Just as God promised, at exactly the right time, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream. Joseph was engaged to a young woman named Mary. The angel told Joseph that Mary would have a baby. The baby would be God's son. They were to name the baby Jesus. Jesus was coming to be the Savior. He would be God with us. Joseph did what the angel said. He married Mary and took care of her. They had to go to Bethlehem to be registered for taxes. And while they were there, Jesus was born. Some time later, wise men from the east arrived in Jerusalem looking for the baby king. They had seen his star and came to worship him. Now King Herod was disturbed by the news. He asked the Jewish chief priests and scribes where the promised Messiah would be born. In Bethlehem, they told the king, because that was what was written by the prophet. Now God promised he would send his son, and he did. God even gave details about where Jesus would be born, and they happened just as he said. Jesus is the Savior God promised. When God makes a promise, he keeps it. So day's one truth is, 
Jesus is the Savior God promised. friends let's do an activity together now please look in your package this bag that should say day one activity have you found it good you should see in here two pieces of paper one plastic spoon and one little bag of sand. Good, you took it out. Also, you're gonna need to go find some glue in your house, okay? So go get the glue and come back. And afterwards, let's start our activity. So you have your glue now, right? So let's just take one piece of paper and we're gonna write on here in big letters with our glue stick, Jesus. So follow me, we're gonna start. All right, so let's take our glue. We wanna make sure we do it flat down, okay? So that we can get big letters. So we're gonna start with J, E, So be careful, okay? You have one more piece of paper, right? On this one, you can write Bible, you can write yes and name, you can write whatever else you'd like um, that is related to today's sermon. And then afterwards, please make sure to write your name on it so that we can see your beautiful work when you bring it to church, okay? All right, friends, that was our activity. I'll see you at craft time. You're gonna do a great craft with Unju something name. And then also we're going to do our memory verse now. All right, let's take out our memory verse of the day. So take out the one with the Ziploc bag that says one on it. You should see little puzzle pieces. Um, take that out and we're going to match it together, okay?
All right, good job. So that this is our memory verse for today, day one. This, you did such a good job, and I'll see you tomorrow at day two. Bye.